Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you are well. So in today's video, we are going to be reacting to this YouTuber from America. His name is Jack and he's really young and he brought a Lamborghini Urus and it was a Mansuri edition. The one thing I must have to say about him is he's young and he's buying these Lamborghinis at a young age, which is inspirational and motivational for all of us because we should be aspiring to get cars like this at a young age and work hard from a young age too. As long as you make the money in a good and right way, it's absolutely fine. And and it's motivational for all of us so today we're going to be reacting to the car he brought to see whether he blew too much money on it or if he made a good purchase so there's a lot of youtubers out there in america and i've noticed a trend recently where they're just spending way too much money on these supercars and that's why i'm here today to basically break down and see whether he actually made a good purchase don't forget to subscribe to my channel give this video a like it only helps my channel grow more and i hope you guys enjoy the video let's do it buying myself a lamborghini urus and I ended up making the decision that I'm gonna buy it, but I go to the bank to wire $360,000 right now to pay for this year. It is such a six years, so I'm so excited to own it. So $360,000 he paid for the car, so that's around between 280 000 to 290,000 pounds in the UK, depending on the exchange rates. Unfortunately, Jack, I'm gonna have to say straight away, you kind of got scammed. So this car only retails for around 220 000 to 230,000 pounds maximum in the UK. Just for a bit of context, he bought the entry level Mansory Urus so it's only an entry level car which comes with the exterior body kit which you will see in the video later on so the entry level Mansory Urus unfortunately only devalues and the value of it in the UK is quite low so you paid around 60 to 70 thousand dollars more than what you should have but anyways let's carry on and see what happens next so this year is gonna be my second Lamborghini and I don't need five freaking cars so so that's right it's his second Lamborghini the first time I actually came across Jack's YouTube channel was when someone forwarded me him buying a Hurricane Evo that was actually a really good specification Evo he got so the car was directly from Lamborghini and he must have paid a good price for that just because of course he brought it directly from the retailer and unfortunately there was a rainstorm in America that flooded his car and yeah that was the last we heard about it trying to figure out what to do with the McLaren or something I'm probably gonna get rid of the McLaren maybe trade it in for a watch or something I'm trying to figure it out because I paid over two hundred thousand dollars for this car and now they're saying I can get like 150 if I'm lucky and I put like 40k into it too so but I've always wanted a year so I really want to get it so he currently has loads of cars in his collection in particular he's pointing out this McLaren he has now I'm not a big fan of McLaren especially the one he's got which is probably a 570 or a 650s yes. those cars just haven't aged well they don't really look as good as they do in 2024 and with McLaren you just end up losing a ton of money when you buy their cars as he mentioned he's probably lost over fifty thousand dollars buying it and it's just not a reliable car overall yours is gonna be perfect because i'm sick of taking just mckinley every time i go for a ride in the lambo or the mclaren i need a supercar that everyone can get into i think he's right i have to agree with him the lamborghini urus is a perfect car to take your family and friends with you it's got the sound to it it's got the aggressive looks it's fast so you can race around and not only that but you don't have to worry about driving it everywhere it's an suv so you don't need to worry about going over bumps so far and of course for him it's perfect if he's going to be taking all his friends and you know family with him I literally said I would never buy another car ever again here I am you know my accountant said I should buy this so just following his lead over here you know just abiding by his rules <laughs> I just wired three hundred and sixty thousand dollars. As of now, it should be on its way. Perfect. Thank you so much. Have a good rest of your day and happy new year. We did it. I wired the money. I just lost three hundred sixty thousand dollars out of my bank account. But yeah, now yeah. So he definitely did lose three hundred sixty thousand dollars for sure. With this purchase, Jack, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to say it's not the best advice an accountant can give their client. So with the Lamborghini he's buying, it's only gonna devalue more because it's an entry level Mansory Urus. It's not like the Urus Performante or it's not like the Venetus S, which you mainly find in Dubai. Those are the crazy Mansory. Lamborghinis you see around with the crazy interior colors the sound of them are nuts and they retail for over four hundred thousand pounds so that's way over half a million in dollars just wouldn't have listened to my accountant if he would have told me that my new four hundred thousand dollar Lamborghini Urus has a custom hundred thousand dollar body kit mansory whatever you want to call it wow so he's now added an extra forty thousand dollars onto the car so unfortunately Jack you're only gonna make your loss greater than what it already is so yeah it's not worth that much it's only about two hundred and ninety thousand dollars i'd say and the body kit unfortunately isn't worth a hundred thousand dollars either but look at this interior guys look how red it is it matches so nice this is one of one there's no lamborghinis that come like this ever so a whole crazy 
the body kit on it. It's so I must say the interior is actually really nice. It's red on red. It's a good interior to go for because it is resellable. Mansory are really good at designing their interiors for the colors of their cars. So they usually have crazy colors like Tiffany blue, green, yellow, red. And this red on red that Jack went for, I must say does look nice. Unfortunately Jack, this car is not one of one. So everyone out there, Mansory actually produce a fair amount of these. If you place an order as well, they could get this delivered to you. And at the end of the video, I'm gonna prove this ain't a one of one car because yeah, as you know how I do it with this channel, I'm gonna be taking you guys out in the Lamborghini Urus Mansory edition too. And it's gonna be the exact same spec as the one that Jack went for as well. It's just gonna be a normal entry level Mansory Urus. I gotta start the Urus for the first time. All right, here we go. Let's see what she sounds like. make it go way crazier. I'm gonna make it way louder. I have to say everyone, it does really sound good. It doesn't sound as crazy as the Venetus S Mansory Urus does sound like. That one sounds crazier than this. But for entry level Urus, it does sound good, but I still do feel like it will need like an Akropovich exhaust. But if you want it sounding absolutely crazy, everyone, you have to have the actual Mansory exhaust on the car. And this is how that sounds like. How much is this hood alone? 40k. The hood? Yeah. It's 40k? I'd say. Yeah, damn. All right. So the hood is actually quite expensive on the car and that price is more or less right. So because it's made out of forged carbon fiber, it's not as easy as repairing. If it does get damaged, you'd actually have to replace the whole hood. So if you are someone out there who's going to be buying a car with any carbon fiber on it, you're better having it protected with something called PPF. So that's paint protection film and it covers your carbon fiber with stone chips or any marks because these are actually quite expensive to replace if you if they are damaged. It's not not as easy as just repairing the hood. Can't wait to get an exhaust on this bitch. It needs to be louder. Yeah, this shit's clean. I'm glad I got this bitch. Just don't want to look at my bank account for a couple days. I'm pretty real to me. I'm pretty sure I'm alive and we're good and I'm about another Lamborghini. I think it's because the first time I bought a Lamborghini, I never knew how to drive a supercar and it all felt so surreal to me, but now it's just like, it doesn't feel the same. There's people that was actually a good acceleration. Seems like he knows how to control the car. And as mentioned earlier, I think the Lamborghini Urus is the perfect car. So it's not hard to drive. It's an SUV. And from the acceleration he done, as you can see, it does still give you that thrill. And I want to say a massive congratulations to Jack for getting his hands on this Lamborghini. I hope you enjoy the car. And overall, Lamborghini Uruses are nice cars to drive well there you have my reaction everyone to jack buying the lamborghini urus mansory edition as you know with my channel i only have to match that type of level so what i'm going to be doing now is taking you guys out in a lamborghini urus mansory and it's going to be the same entry level specs so this is the front of the mansory urus everyone
Well, there you have it, everyone. That was my reaction to being inside a Lamborghini Urus Mansory. I hope you guys enjoyed the loud accelerations we was given the car whilst we were inside it. I hope you guys enjoyed the sound. It is quite hard to capture the sound on camera. It's not the same as it is in real life. But overall, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Comment down below on who I should react to next and what cars you want to see on the channel. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe, share and like. And I'll catch you guys on my next video.